factor crap number what is this five? Oh my gosh let's go um so i was uh going down the rabbit hole thinking that like do i have adhd and kind of researching all of that and i found a video by the healthy gamer gg on youtube called the curse of adhd and in that video he mentions that um eating well and regular exercise helps alleviate the symptoms of adhd and I thought that was really interesting because at least in my mind, like, okay, eating healthy could, you know, kind of make sense. But to me, I don't know why there was like a disconnect between physical activity helping with uh, ADHD. Because at least to me, the red flag pops up because um, ADHD, or at least what I perceive it to be within me, like, I don't know, like the, <laughs> the, the tinfoil hat, I think I have it, um, is like the constant wiggling and not able to be sitting still. That's all physical activity. I'm, I'm like wiggling. Um, so how would more wiggling make it better, but maybe I get all the wiggles out. So I had to look into it. And so I found an article titled Managing Childhood and Adolescent Attention, Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder with Exercise, a Systematic Review. And this was published by, um, uh, quite a few names that I don't think I can pronounce. Um, in 2017 <laughs> and um, it's a systematic review of uh, 30 studies and they concluded that um, physical activity does help in children and adolescents and so that's the limitation of this right is that we're that it's just studies showing um, or researching children and adolescents um, so you know if we think of adults to be extrapolating a little bit um, but no adverse effects were found and uh, moderate to intense aerobic exercises um, were beneficial um, and well tolerated uh, for the children. And there was no negative, there's no downsides. Um, but something that they mention is that they, uh, they want to do more studies or they're looking to more studies about specific ide like, or ideal exercise prescriptions that could best help. But I imagine just the more the merrier, right? Like within within reason, you know, it says moderate to intense. So that would be just like playing a sport or hitting the gym regularly, some cardio every day. Um, but yeah, so true, it's true, it's a fact, it's not crap. That exercise uh, does have a positive effect on ADHD in children and adolescents, but you know, we, 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 we I, I would assume adults as well.